It's Feast Week in college basketball, and Kentucky's hosting North Florida the day before Thanksgiving. So since we're in the holiday spirit, I'm having my own little Thanksgiving dinner here in Rupp Arena during the game, and I'm going to eat every piece of food they sell in this building. So take a walk with me, and I'll meet you at the table for this big feast. All right, if you're going to do Thanksgiving, you have to go to Kroger, right? I worked at Kroger. I worked there every Thanksgiving. Rupp Arena now has a Kroger. Let's go get the supplies. We can't get the concession stand. We have a great spread here. Since they have it, we should probably get some sushi, right? I mean, spicy California roll. That's always good. Some applesauce. Normally, I get free drinks from the media room, but you know, being a holiday at all, I'm going to splurge. What, what do we want from Kroger? How about a monster energy drink? It's caffeine up for this uh, this feast. Typical you scan situation. How does this work? So do I leave it? Leave it. Okay. Put, it on there. Put that on there. So may I, I have just a chicken sandwich. Okay. All right, we got our Kroger, got our Chick-fil-A. Let's keep moving on to the next one. You just, you just gotta follow the skyscape up there. I'm watching my figure today. I better stick with the uh, traditional Coney, please. Thank you very much. So go great with what I have. How about a uh, pulled pork nachos? Yeah, my friend. A pork nacho right here. Got it. Uh-oh. I mean, what could go wrong here? I'm gonna regret this. <laughs> the buffalo mac and cheese, the short rib nachos, I need a pretzel, and a Hunt Brothers pizza. Doritos mac and cheese, that is one of the all time favorites. You guys really have to try it. So let's get a Doritos mac and cheese. Always say please and thank you. I meant to find flowers, we'll go empty face. Never found the flowers. This is quite a Rupp Arena Thanksgiving spread here. Can't wait to dive in. I do not like the candles. Burning down Rupp Arena is not something I'm interested in, but I do like the ambiance they add. Something just still doesn't feel, uh, I'm not dressed for Thanksgiving. Let's dig in. We're gonna start with the uh, city barbecue, barbecue nachos. Are you really eating barbecue nachos if you're not getting messy? But if you're coming to Rupp Arena, I've got a lot to try and it's early in the process. This right here hits every time. I wouldn't rate this, would order again, and probably will at the next game. Up next, we have our buffalo mac and cheese. This is the one thing I accidentally forgot to order at the regular concession stand, and the gentleman working said I missed the best thing on the menu. So this is their top recommended food item. It's new this year. Looks like we have a pretty standard uh, mac and cheese with crushed Doritos on top. I have not had this uh, yet this season, but I'm very excited about it. You can't have Thanksgiving without mac and cheese. My man over there uh, at the concession stand was not lying. Overall, still good, and I would order it again. I told them you you made me order it, and that's, I'm glad I did. That's the food sent from the, come on now, sent from the heavens, the angels is talking to this man. So good. Wherever you are, pretzel can be a great call. Take this to your seat, pinch one off for the neighbor next to you at the game. Everybody loves you. We know where this came from, another classic. Also, right now there's a game going on. Kentucky's up like 23 to 13 or something. We'll, we'll catch the highlights. I went traditional for what we're doing. I assume there's a pickle on here. Yep, got a couple of pickles. Mm. This is so stupid. What are we doing? I'm missing the game for this. Up next, some food that needs no introduction. They've been the longtime pizza sponsor here at Rupp Arena. We have Hunt Brothers. I've had one of these, I've had a thousand. Spent many a long nights in Rupp Arena living off Hunt Brothers pizza. I'm not gonna call it my, my favorite pizza. I'm not even gonna put it in my top 20 pizzas. I'm just hungry and celebrating Thanksgiving. Mm. Do a little, a little dip there. Just brush it a little bit, a little Picasso. I've been to every UK game for like the last 10 years. This might be a new favorite. Sushi and Rupp Arena, like people do. This is Rupp Arena popcorn. Same recipe they had when they opened the joint. We don't put, we don't put any highlights on our popcorn boxes like uh, some former basketball programs that used to be good. Every Thanksgiving meal has a main event. What is it? Monster Energy. Just kidding. Turkey. You don't even like it, but you have it because we were told to like it and have it every Thanksgiving. We don't have turkey here, but we have our main event. New to Rupp Arena this season. It's blowing everyone's minds. Short rib nachos presented in a basketball, a souvenir bowl. Souvenir bowl 
It's at all the concession stands. They're not paying me to say this. In fact, I had to pay them to do this. Rather than some damn good nachos. How's the ice cream line? I'm about to go. It's I'm here at Rupp Arena, 54 to 23. I already had my Thanksgiving feast. I ate every food item in the building, but you might have noticed we we're missing one thing. And yes, I save room for dessert. Let's go hit that ice cream line. What, what do you anticipate this wait time? Have you done this before? You a pro? Our first time. It's way down there. If I got this in me. Holy cow. Yep. Still here. We'll get there. We're moving. I'm not in the back anymore. As much as I want to finish off this feast with rubber and ice cream, the line's just becoming too much. I can't miss any more of the basketball, so I have to dip out. But Natalie here, it's her first time. She's going to wait it out and she's going to tell me how good it was. Natalie, tell everybody happy Thanksgiving. 